All right, all systems are go. Let's continue. Oh, Anna. It's time for her help. Blunderklump. POW camp. Wow. Well, the French look like they're enjoying themselves. Life in POW camps. So you get segregated based on your rank? Sounds about right. Okay, there are a bunch of doors here. I'm just making sure there's nothing outside. Wow. This is a big place. May 8th, 1916. I've been stuck here in this POW camp south of Reims for 11 months now. I think it was Reims, but... My health is picking up and I'm even walking again at last. All thanks to Anna. Marie's last letter worried me. Victor is very sick, and they don't have the resources to take him, uh, care of him in Saint Mihel. I must get him out of here. And by him, I mean me. And I just butchered reading that, so sorry. <laughs> okay, let's check out what's in this room. This man needs medical attention. Okay, this one has an opening, so... Huh? I'm just gonna move this here for now. Uh, I have nothing to give you, so we'll come back to you later, my friend. So this guy wants a nice uh, smoke in order to get some fruits from him. <laughs> Everyone wants to trade something for something, so we just gotta figure out where the start of this trade is going to be. I need wires. Let's go back here. Okay, <laughs> guess I'm not allowed to play a card game with them. Oh, I see something. Letter from a Hungarian prisoner. Okay, and I'm gonna try to figure out this one because it seems like a pretty complex puzzle set. <laughs> Outhouses. Um, I need something to throw. Oh, here we go. Let's just check up here real quick and make sure there's nothing. So, I'm gonna make sure the water is connected. I just do. Oh, I guess it's already done now. German ID tag. Okay, so now that I've got this rock or coal, whatever, I can go up here and hopefully get the water working. <laughs> that was a pretty easy fix. We should work like that in real life. <laughs> get a problem with a pipe? There was something at it. <laughs> what did he say? That sounded pretty funny. <laughs> it's probably like, uh, let's see, okay, it's... <laughs> what a funny scene. What do I get from this though? Oh, wires. Whatever these are. Okay, there's step one. I'm gonna check left here, make sure there's nothing real quick though. Oh, something. 
A notebook. I can go back here. Okay, now I need to go upstairs to that one other guy and trade my wires or whatever these are for his item. I forget what it was, but I remember he wanted it, so. Oh, medical supplies. Good old prison bargaining. <laughs> I think Carl's sound of success is the best so far out of every character. <laughs> This is also possibly the most uplifting scene, even though it's in a prison. Alright. <laughs> I did laundry! Good job! Um, so I have a scarf now. Okay, I'm more fashionable, which means I can escape better, I think. What does this guy want again? Ah, oh, yes, he wants that. Wait. Oh no, I can't get those yet until I uh, do the next one. Okay. I'm trying to figure out what the whole point of this scarf was. Is it the poker game? Oh! I don't know if it's poker. I just assumed. <laughs> you got a match to play our game. That's how it goes. <laughs> and now we can visit our chef friend. Oh, no, 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 I see. <laughs> it's a funny way to get me down from a shelf. Break the shelf! A biscuit box. Oops. It's right there, how can you not reach that? Just use your tiptoes. <laughs> anyway, got meat for the doggy. I'm glad he leaves his post so easily. The fallen dogs so we're waiting for it to be nighttime, and then we're gonna break out of the camp. I get it. I missed an item though. QQ. Who is this guy anyway? Oh, cut faster. Oh. Was that right? Okay. <laughs> oh, Freddy's time. Oh, that is pretty sad. But Freddy's still alive, I knew it! And he's emitting light from his body, like a true warrior. Oh, I need a battery. I 
need more batteries. Wow, well, we're both okay. How about that? Aha! What is this? Flashlights. Yes, I know, we need power. Can you fix this? Oh, here's the battery. <laughs> I was like, how do we fix it? Oh, tab. Armored vehicles. And no man's land. Finally gets mentioned. It's pretty midway into the game. What are these? Broken German bayonet. Ah. I just picked one up, but I'm not sure what it does. Oh. Oh, 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 okay. <laughs> I'm like, wait a second, I should be up there. Okay, what was that? It looked very red and like a brick. So it must be nothing like that. Is this going to be used on the tank? Yes. Are we going to <laughs> commandeer this tank? Oh, yes. <laughs> yes. Where's your tank now, Von Dorf? What? Hold on. <laughs> he just runs off in the middle of this area like nothing's gonna happen. Okay. So he was right about that. Unfortunately, I still know what that means. Let me just try this lever, see what happens. Okay. Show me your puzzle. specific shape. Okay, so we need it to look like a... So we need to rotate this. <laughs> that is interesting. Right. Is that right? I think that's right. It's like build the bear, except it's made out of metal and weighs a lot. And it's also not very cuddly. If this isn't right, there's going to be some explaining to do. Oh, of course. Why do we need to stop there? Let's build more things. <laughs> okay, just make these all match to the square. Funny though. Like, I'm not sure if that's right, but we'll try to try it. Because on his, it's just a perfect square, and mine, it does not look like a perfect square, but you know, if, if 
the puzzle piece fits, then sure. Okay, is there a third piece? No. Thank you. Slow down. We need to figure out what we're doing first of all. So I need to make it face... Gonna, I'm gonna put this on top of the tank. I get that much, but I need to make it face the other direction, right? Do I have to have Walt stop and put it on? Wait, wait, I get it. Get away. <laughs> okay then. This makes me think of Batman for some reason, this music. Ah, shift is the fire. I just held shift because I assumed it would aim, but even better. Guys, just I can't hurt them. Okay, <laughs> I'm like trying to fire at them. Oh, blimps! Wait, come at me, blimps! I'm ready for you. Or not? Well, that guy's probably not alive anymore. It's a good thing we can't move very fast either, because. These mines would be a problem otherwise. Oh god. Well then! Okay, let's try that again without the whole getting hit by a shell. I need to snipe that other cannon from a farther range than before. <laughs> then I'm just gonna keep spamming the gun, like, I see no reason not to. That's right, you couldn't see me before I shot you. It's a good thing we have infinite ammo in this tank, because otherwise things would be a problem. Oh, nice machine gun you got there. Wait, oh, I see. <laughs> Took a little bit, but I got it. I'll say, I, there's dynamite on this thing, I, I can see what's going to happen here. Get ready for it. Yeah. We're okay though, so it doesn't matter. requires precision aiming. <laughs> there we go. Oh. <laughs> Just blow up everything. I don't even know why I'm destroying, but... Clearly it's a good idea. I think the scene is just for you to blow up a, a bunch of things. I don't see any purpose to it. <laughs> oh, we're at 
the French side now. Hey guys, how's it going? Lucky Freddy was given a hero's welcome by the French forces. Emile wrote to Anna to let her know that her father was free and out of harm's way. Freddy and Emile's reunion, however, would be short-lived. May 14th, 1916. Freddy was sent to the Somme, while Emile's regiment was quartered near a small village at the top of a hill. The village was called Vauquois. Vauquois. This is where the conflict had moved underground. Holed up in their trenches, the two camps dug tunnels and galleries. The underground war had begun. Okay, well, I'm going to stop it for now and edit what I have because I have a pretty decent amount of footage. So, thank you guys for watching, and we will be back with more Valiant Hearts at some point in the future. Take care. Oh.